Hello everyone, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Today we have an amazing island tour ready for you guys. And it's very special to me because this is my mom's island that she's been working on for months. Um, the theme of the island is a European winery. Um, so let's go ahead and look at the map and get started. Oh my gosh, look at these beautiful villagers, wow. And on the map I can tell that there's a lot going on on the right side. And let's go ahead and see, I see those three bridges. I'm excited to show you guys and love the bridge automatically in the front. It just adds a lot of detail. This is a very fancy setup. And let's go ahead and pick up these gifts. Um, let's see what she packed for us. Ooh, girl, I need to eat. I need to drink this. Sparkling cider champagne. Beret, of course I will wear that. Love all the greenery. It's very landscaped and beautiful. Ooh, here we got a little stand for coffee. I love this setup for a, just a small little coffee stand. That is very nice. And here we have a very realistic road with bikes and cars. Seems like this car is getting fixed. Really like the code for the road. A lot of vehicles here because it seems like it's a very busy city. So that's great. And yes, I love this train station illusion it is absolutely brilliant it really does look like there's trains coming i see that we got a flower shop it really looks like a building that you can just walk right into bakery section here next to a villager's house Marshall's got his little bakery cafe. And here are some beautifully stacked iron seating areas along the canals and bridges. Fruits everywhere, there's goods everywhere, very stacked. I love all the colors in this cute little market it is so cool and fun to look at and we've got these very beautiful canals with bridges beautiful beautiful okay let's go down here a lot of Landscaping again, hedges. I see that little swan. Um, we got a villager's house right here. This is Bee's house. And we got this little section, seating areas. Oh, hello. And we got this painting area. Very adorable. And this lookout. I love the fencing used. Beautiful, beautiful view. Absolutely stunning. Beautiful house. Exteriors. We've got beautiful building right here. I love the red brick. It looks very historic. And there is little balconies down there. And we got some construction going on. This little pathway that leads us to 
Red's Beach. We've got a little laundry area. And is this another apartment complex? This is great. It's actually very great to have two sections of the same because that's how it is in real life. I mean, you don't always just have one apartment complex. And I really like how you can just walk right in and the house really blends into the apartment. Here we have another coffee section with the coffee truck delivering fresh coffee beans. And the neighbor. Ooh, we can see a little sneak peek of the winery. That is absolutely beautiful. Here we got the Chanel store. There it is. Beautiful building. And we have the tea shop. This is nice. I love the planters. And I can tell those little hints of green. We've got a little picnic area right on the water. He is having a good time. Okay, here up ahead is the actual vineyard. So let's go ahead and take a look. Here's that vineyard. Ooh, love it. Love all the purple that I'm seeing. Oh, wow. This is really beautiful. Here we've got the grapes being harvested. And again, I really love how there's a bunch of these pergolas. And here you can sit down, get a drink. Ooh, a lot of vines. And beautiful pergolas again. Ooh. Oh, so cute. With me with the, the harvest backpack in this area. And we got a nice relaxing sitting area. So let's go ahead and go down. And we did not see this little pizza restaurant. Oh, love this. Really love the pergola at the top. That is a beautiful detail. And this guy is just walking around you look very fancy. I like your outfit, dude. Oh my gosh, you are... Okay, you're getting in the way, but it's okay, because you live here. I mean, this is your place. Okay, this is a little surf shop, beach, little shop. And here is Nook's Cranny. For those of you who want to cover it all up and make something new out of it, this is amazing. And I see the museum peeking through. Very traditional setup with a bunch of statues and the banners. I love that. We've got a Really, really adorable small shop for antiques. That is just so cute and small. I love that. And we've got Able Sisters right here with clothing on display. Ice cream stand, it's very casual with a truck, boat rentals, and the dock. Fish and chips, 
another one of those adorable little shops love that and yeah that just shows that you don't always have to make a very grand shop it can be very mini got this house Oh my goodness, here we've got a little bar. And we have the reception check-in area. And then the bar. This is very moody, set in the nighttime. Ooh, love the lighting. Ooh, we've got some karaoke with the disco balls. This is a very fun setup. And... Yeah, we've got the records on the walls. Very nice, very fun. Ooh, this is a little bathroom lounge and a lot of dark wood tones in here. So yeah, we got a seating area and then we've got some stalls for the bathroom. And yes, this beautiful seafood restaurant. I love this. It's just so cool. Like, it's just very creative. I love the fish as the fish tanks as the table. That is very cool. And we've got the kitchen back here with these absolutely beautiful chairs that I just love. And we've got a little piano bar back here i see that this is the dance floor the piano back there a lot of cool lighting and then we have another house this is the bed and breakfast i can tell by the sign it looks like a small business almost a little bit cottagey and here's a little check-in area. And then we will make our way to the left. Here we've got a very beautiful bedroom setup. I really like how the couch is right at the foot of the bed. With a desk and the little room service. And then we've got this bathroom. Amazing light woods in here. I love the tile on, as the wallpaper. And we've got a laundry area. And I love these wood partitions. This is a very beautiful bathroom. And this is the little common area game room for the kids to just come in here, play around. And then also the little internet areas and there's like some board games. Two beds and then there's two bunk beds. So a lot of beds. I wish I could climb up here. But yeah, this is very nice. I love the floor. This is probably the floor that I always go for. And we've got the breakfast area, very nice setup. And we've got the kitchen, cafe dining. And then we'll go to the right side of the beach. Writing section right on the water. And a lot of wheat fields, which I really like. And we're making our way to the campsite. Fire going, barbecue, and a little laundry. A landscaped little garden back here. This
I really love this scaffolding. I want to use that. It seems very interesting. And the paint cans. We've got a post office. A pub. Bar. Very cool. I mean, it's very nice how you can make a building with just a couple walls because like there's not there's nothing behind there and it's like an illusion and it really works very nice a lot of buildings stacked and that is all always good to see oh we have not seen this this is a garden it's very nice to see uh, a little space for plants very nice and we've got a restaurant on the beach very interesting with the two fencing I actually really like how they look together blanket picnic spot and fishing shack and a lot of fishes stacked up the sink so guys thank you for watching this has been a very fun time i hope you guys enjoyed this island more videos coming soon of speed builds and island tours so if you haven't already you can subscribe and you'll get a chance to watch those new videos coming up i will see you guys in another one goodbye guys